European football is back. It's the Champions League final round of group stage games. Uh, welcome to the Football Champions League preview. Let's start with Manchester United. They are playing Cisco Moscow tonight. They just need a draw. They're pretty much through, although technically not. That's right. I'm sure Jose Mourinho would like to have had this night off. Mm. They lost to Basel a couple of weeks ago, which has put a span on the work somewhat. Great win against Arsenal at the weekend. Manchester derby on Sunday, so he doesn't want to exert himself too much tonight. But I can't see anything other than a win for the United side. OK, Chelsea face up to Madrid next. Um, what do they need to do? Are they, are they through? What's the state of play there? Not quite. As long as they match Roma's result, they will top the group tonight. It would have been really good to see Diego Costa back in London, at least with the squad he can't play, of course, but he's been left behind, maybe sensibly, on Atletico's part, just to avoid any controversy. But I can see that being a draw tonight, but that should be enough for Chelsea. OK, Celtic, the other British club in the Champions League, they're playing for a Europa League place. Obviously, they were paired up with the likes of PSG and Barnes, so a bit unlucky for them. But they can still carry on playing European football this season, can't they? Yeah, I think when Brendan Rodgers saw the draw, he thought, if we can get third, we'll be doing OK. So they basically have a playoff tonight with Anderlecht. The winner of that will go into the Europa League. Celtic a draw will be enough for them. And I think that would represent success for the Glasgow side. Well, PSG are pretty much really through again. I mean, their goal difference is far superior, but at least it's a chance to watch potential winners in action tonight. Absolutely. A lot of people are tipping their Neymar and back Cavani. What a front line. They've got Bayern Munich, who they've already beaten once, and they'll just want to just cement their place as one of the favourites, I'm sure. Well, you can stay up to date with all the action and all the goals as they fly in tonight on another football on both Twitter and Facebook, and we'll have live blogs on the website for you.